What? Sorry. You just... It's been a long couple years. I'm waiting to do this. God. My heart's beating so fast right now. Alright. Let's do this. Everyone loves ice cream. Ice cream, you scream, we all ice cream is probably not ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. My name is Joe Biden and I love ice cream. I mean, even people who are lactose intolerant love ice cream, you know? They can't have it, but they'll, they'll sure eat it. But think about what exactly is ice cream, right? Like, is it a solid? Is it a liquid? I mean, the one moment it's in a bowl, and the next it's completely dissolved on your tongue. I mean, what kind of stuff does that? No one knows. No one knows what ice cream is. But because everyone loves ice cream, no one questions ice cream. And because no one questions ice cream, everyone buys ice cream. And when you buy something, you depend on that something. And when you depend on that something, that something controls you. So it makes sense that ice cream, specifically Bluebell ice cream, one of the United States leading ice cream brands with their homemade original vanilla, would be a front for a secret organization known as the New World Order. That's right, you heard me right. NWO for short. You see, the New World Order's one purpose is to rid the world of population down to roughly 2 billion from our 7 billion now in hopes to create a new world and a new order, hence the name. So it makes sense that having ice cream, a product that everyone loves, everyone enjoys, no one questions, they'd use that as a way to get inside the heads of the people. We should have seen this all along, hadn't we? We should have seen this coming. But you're probably asking yourself, why ice cream? I'll tell you why. Because everyone loves ice cream. Adults love ice cream. Kids love ice cream. Old people love ice cream. Even dogs love ice cream. Ice cream? More like ice cream because the New World Order is using Bluebell to take over the world one half gallon at a time. It's about time we've done something for it. There it is. Bluebell runs an incredibly tight working schedule for their employees. They have their workers start their work day 3, 4 a.m. in the morning. So by the time the world's already up, ready to hit their grocery store, Bluebell would have pushed enough product to cover your local grocer and then some. <laughs> so while you're sleeping in La La Land, thinking about good stuff and high tides, Bluebell is making sure that their line of product is right under your nose, right when you wake up. I mean, if that's not control, I don't know what is. Hey. I'm outside Bluebell Kermes right now. Um, it's 3.30 in the morning at a gas station, hoping to get some action on what's going to happen. This morning, uh, things are not looking good for Bluebell. Back. Something is up. But think about it. Couldn't ice cream be delivered at any time of the day? I mean, why would you have to choose 3, 4 a.m. in the morning? I mean, couldn't the workers for Bluebell deliver at normal hours like any other delivery man? I'm in a deserted place out in the middle of nowhere. Um, God, it is creepy out here. It is creepy out here. Not a thing in sight except Bluebell Creamery of all places. It's like as if a whole town sprang up around Bluebell. Something's up right now. I can feel it. There she blows. Oh boy. Oh boy. 
<laughs> red-handed, young sir. You're red-handed. <laughs> Of course, right when the cameras roll out, the coppers roll in. Had a cop tailing me for the past 30. Fortunately, we're all good. I was able to weed them off. But this goes to show, I think Bluebell's in it more than just for the ice cream. There's something else, the laws behind it. They have protection. Why do they have protection? Why do they want to be protected? It doesn't make sense. The only thing that does make sense is conspiracy. They're trying to take over the world, placing their ice cream one half gallon at a time. All I can do is wait. All I can do is wait. <laughs>